so you know i said before how much i like the cert teams and the training that they do here's a little bit of urban uh search and rescue right if you get ready to go search you get you some paint spray paint come up to the building you don't want to do it on a window you don't want to do it on a door because stuff could be open you don't want to do anything that's going to be obscured so see if the door opens out you don't want to put it over here so the door opening will, will obscure it so say on the side of the building you come in you get ready to search when you go in the building you put a big x right that lets somebody know somebody's in there when you come out that tells you that you're done okay at the top you're going to put the time and date that you left the building so let's say today is october 1st 2013 okay and we got done with the search it's three o'clock in the morning now so zero three that lets us know that we were done searching and on october 1st at three in the morning okay that's not the only information though that this thing can have say we come in and we found four live people that we rescued so down at the bottom we put four live unfortunately though you know there was a little bit of bad guy action or, or it got cold or somebody you got hit in the head with a with a stick who, who knows and so you got one person deceased okay let's know we found one live person one dead person okay now we want to know who did that right so over here we're going to put the ID of the search team and if you're going to if you're going to be doing you saw you're probably going to be part of emergency management so you're going to have a search team let's say we're shepherd school one ss1 that's going to be our ID number on the right we put about anything that we found that that might be a danger you know so um broken gas line okay that lets them know hey there's a broken gas line here it could be you could say rats it could say you know disease you know it could say you know structure damage whatever and that's a down and dirty um x marking for urban search and rescue now this isn't the only this isn't the only thing out there there's other methods and there's a box method that um codes officials use for building safety so if you see this this might not mean this this might be whether the house is condemned or not whether it's safe to go in right so it pays to know the different markings but if you see this this is basically what FEMA does so I hope that's useful to you and until next time you catch it online www.tngun.com